welcome guys to today's video uh here comes another series of challenge which reads a to the power of b minus b to the power of a is equals to 17 so we are looking for the possible value of a sorry b and a so please if you are new here kindly subscribe and by the time you subscribe please turn on the notification button so that you get notified anytime i drop videos on mass so simply say solution in order for us to solve this solution okay then write down the question which is a to the power of b minus b to the power of a is equals to 17 okay okay we are not having this so we can simply write this to be a to the power of b open bracket close bracket or to one minus b to the power of a Open bracket close bracket or to or to one which is equals to 17 which is equals to 17 equals to 17 okay having this having this recall my one is also equals to 2 divided by 2 so 2 divided by 2 is going to give us what it's going to give us 1 so we so can simply write this to a to the power of b open bracket close bracket to the power of 2 over 2 minus b to the power of a open bracket close bracket to the power of 2 over 2 is equals to 17 okay having done this having done this recall from a principle of indices which says we are having a to the power of m over n is also equals to a to the power of 1 over n open bracket close bracket to the power of of m so if you apply this this true at this point we can simply have this to be a to the power of b over 2 open bracket or to the power of 2 minus b to the power of a over 2 open bracket close the bracket or to the power of 2 is equals to uh 17 is equals to 17 so the equation c remains the same not to change because if we put in this it's going to cancel off this and we are going back to this and if you put in this this to cancel off this so we'll go back to this so it, it still remains uh the same still remains the same okay now what then is our next step we we'll say let we we'll say let let a to the power of b over 2 equal equal y and b to the power of a over 2 equal x okay since we've done this we can simply write this to be so wherever we see a to the power of b over 2 we we'll put y and wherever we see b to the power of a over 2 we we'll put x so simply have this to be y or square minus x or square is equals to 17. Now the equation now looks more easier to work with. Now it's more easier to work with. So recall a square plus sorry minus b square is equals to a plus b open bracket times a minus b. Sorry, I'm I'm using some some identity similar to this, but don't confuse this for this. So we are having a square minus b square is also equals to a plus b times a minus b. So if you obey this principle here, we simply have this to be simply have this to be y plus x open bracket close bracket or open bracket uh y minus s close bracket is equals to your 17 is also equals to 17 times 1. So 17 times 1 remains 17. So we can put here to be 17 times times 1. Okay? 17 times 1. Also note. Note. Note that x plus y plus x is is greater than y minus x. So in other words, y plus s will be taking the big value. Y minus s will be taking the smaller value. Okay, we are not having y plus s is equal to 17 and y minus x is equal to 1. So with this, we can solve this simultaneously using uh, the elimination method. So if you should do, if you should use the elimination method, we can put a, 
We can draw a sign here, then say y plus y is going to give us 2y, right? Plus x minus s is going to give us 0, and 17 plus 1 is going to give us equals to what? Equals to 18, right? Equals to 18. So this is, we are having 18 here. Okay, so therefore our y is equals to, is equals to, is equals to 9. So if we want to look for value for x, we can say, let's pick equation 1. We can say y plus x is equals to what? Is equals to 17. Right? Then we can make, I will know y to be 9. So we can say 9 plus x is equals to what? 17. Therefore my x is equals to what? 17 minus what? 9. So my x is equals to, is equals to what? Is equals to 8. Is equals to 8. So the value of x is now equals to 8. So we know x to be 8 and y to be what? To be 9. Y to be 9. I recall, recall we said y is equals to a to the power of b over 2. Right? And we say x is equals to b to the power of a over 2. So we know our y to be 9. So we can see 9 is equals to a to the power of b over 2 and s is equals to 8 8 is equals to b to the power of a over 2 so for us to find the value of a and b we can simply square both sides we can simply square both sides we can simply square both sides of two equations two values so this was to square this we are having 81 is equals to a to the power of what b and we're having this to be 64 is equals to b to the power of what of a b to the power of a so if we have this now so what then is the value for a and b okay let's see let's see how we can solve this recall 81 is equals to uh 3 to the power of of 4 and your 64 is equals to 4 to the power of of 3 so we can say 3 to the power of 4 is equals to a to the power of b and 4 to the power of 3 is equals to b to the power of, of a. So by comparison, we can say b is equals to 4 and a is equals to is equals to a is equals to 3. So let's 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 see whether the value of a, a and b are correct by substituting the value of a and b into our equation recall our equation say a to the power of b minus b to the power of a is equals to is equals to 17. i will know our a to be 3 and our b to be to be 4 right okay we can write this to be 3 to the power of what of 4 3 to the power of 4 minus what is your b 4 4 what is your a 3 is equals to 17 and 3 to the power of 4 is going to give us what 81 minus 4 to the power of 3 is going to give us what 64 is equals to 17 81 minus 64 which is 8164 uh, so 1 minus 4 is cannot we can borrow one from here making it 11 11 minus 4 is going to give us 7 so you are left with what with 7 here, 7 minus 1 is going to give us 7 minus 6, sorry, 7 minus 6 is going to give us what? 1. So we are having 17 is equals to 17. So the value of A and B in this challenge is correct. So please, if you find this video useful and interesting, please don't forget to click on the subscription button and turn on the notification bell. Bye for now and see you in my subsequent video. God bless you.